say right now it's time to head outside on Friday. I mean, it's sunny, it's nice, feels like summer. Hello to you, Betsy. <laughs> Hi there, Laura. What a beautiful afternoon we have going on. And, you know, the breeze is blowing out here. You can tell with the hair. But I'll tell you what, it's actually making it fantastically comfortable. The only problem is the cottonwood is just blowing like crazy, too. But as we go through the evening, look at the folks who are out here at Edgewater Beach enjoying this beautiful evening. The water temperature out off of the lakeshore is pretty chilly, but the surface water temp is probably not too bad. Folks are taking that in right now, cooling off a little bit. This is going to be a great place over the weekend because you're going to need to cool off. Let's take a look at the forecast over the next few hours. We are talking about temperatures fading back into the low 70s and mostly clear skies continuing for us. We're setting up for a gorgeous sunset. So if you get in place now, you can really enjoy a picnic and kind of settle in. Radar not showing anything. We did have some showers that passed through earlier, but they were very hit or miss. And once the sun came out, it popped the temperatures. Friends, we're still sitting in the low 80s right now, and this brisk west wind is helping to make it feel really cool. You can see how what's left of the clouds continue to move out to the east, and that is as drier air and high pressure is moving in. Now, here's the key. It's a bunch of hot air that is moving in. This hot air that is banked out in the western part of the country is finally sliding east. At the same time, we will have humidity moving to the north from the deep south, and that means that we are going to not only be getting hot this weekend, but late weekend and into early next week, the humidity is really going to be cranking up. So as far as your national design, our hour by hour forecast goes, I mean, things are looking phenomenal for the start of the weekend. We're going 88 for tomorrow. We could have some places that top out at 90. Sunny skies will abound. Notice we start off in the low 70s and quickly make it to the mid 80s by the time we hit noon. Mid-afternoon will be our peak temps of the day. Again, upper 80s expected, and that southwest breeze is really going to make it feel phenomenal. If you are going to venture out on the lake, do be advised going out will be fine. No problems. Coming back in is probably going to be a little choppy because we have a southwest wind that is expected at 50 to 20 and that'll kick up those two to four footers but again it's all about direction when you're dealing with those two to four footers all right here's your union home mortgage forecast and boy it is setting up to be a very summery start unofficial start to summer right this is the first weekend ohio is open it's going to be a busy busy time for us mostly sunny skies for sunday temperatures up around 90 we're still going to be very warm right around 90 on monday but monday i think is the day when you're really going to start to feel the humidity here We'll pop up some afternoon thunderstorms, I think, by Monday evening. Then better chances for scattered storms on Tuesday, and then especially Wednesday, we'll finally start to see that fading out a little bit, but the temperatures stay on the warm side, even as we head into next weekend. So as of right now, it looks like our best chances for rain stay with the weekdays. So, Laura, you got to get out and enjoy on the weekend while you can. I mean, this weekend just is so good. It's, it's yep. so good. All right, Betsy, thanks. That's all I can say. <laughs>